Channel Storm Rider in 2026, the USS Zumwalt DDG-1000 stands as one of the most advanced and futuristic destroyers ever built for the United States Navy. Designed to operate both independently and as part of larger naval strike groups, this warship represents a bold leap into the future of naval warfare. It's not just a ship, it's a floating powerhouse of stealth technology and firepower that redefines what a destroyer can be. Built by Bath Ironworks in Maine and developed under the DDX program, the Zumwalt class was envisioned to bring next-generation technologies into active service. The result is a destroyer that looks nothing like its predecessors, yet carries unmatched capability and versatility for 21st century missions. At first glance, the most striking feature of the USS Zumwalt is its design. The ship's sharp, angular shape immediately stands out. It almost looks like something from a sci-fi movie. This unique geometry isn't just for looks. It's a carefully engineered stealth feature. The hull uses a tumble-home design, meaning the sides of the ship slope inward rather than outward. Combined with radar-absorbent materials and a smooth exterior, this makes the Zumwalt appear on radar more like a small fishing vessel than a 15,000-ton destroyer. It's one of the largest destroyers ever built, yet one of the hardest to detect. This stealth capability gives the ship a huge tactical advantage, allowing it to operate closer to enemy shores or slip undetected through contested waters. Powering the USS Zumwalt is an Advanced Integrated Power System, IPS, which sets it apart from traditional warships. Instead of separate engines for propulsion and onboard systems, the Zumwalt uses two massive Rolls-Royce MT-30 gas turbines and two smaller Rolls-Royce RR4500 turbines to generate a total of around 78 megawatts of electricity. To put that in perspective, that's enough power to supply a small city. The entire ship runs on this electrical system. Everything from the engines to the radar to the weapon systems. This all-electric design not only increases efficiency, but also opens the door for future upgrades like railguns and directed energy weapons that demand enormous power. It's a ship truly built with the future in mind. In terms of size and structure, the Zumwalt measures around 610 feet long, with a displacement of approximately 15,600 tons. Despite its massive scale, the ship is operated by a remarkably small crew, around 140 sailors, compared to the 300-plus crew members needed for older destroyers. This drastic reduction is made possible by extensive automation throughout the vessel. Advanced computer systems control almost every aspect of ship operations, from navigation and propulsion to damage control and weapons management. The crew can monitor and manage these systems from the ship's highly digitalized combat information center, which feels more like a high-tech command hub than a traditional naval bridge. The reduced crew not only saves operational costs, but also reflects a shift toward more intelligent, automated warfare. When it comes to combat capability, the Zumwalt is designed to perform a wide range of missions, from land attack and surface warfare to anti-air and anti-submarine operations. Its primary weapon system originally included two advanced gun systems, AGS, 150 mm naval guns capable of firing long-range land attack projectiles, LRLAP, over 80 miles with pinpoint accuracy. However, due to the high cost of these specialized rounds, the Navy later explored alternative munitions and potential repurposing of these massive guns for future technologies, such as hypervelocity projectiles or even rail guns. Still, the guns remain an impressive feat of naval engineering, built to deliver devastating fire support far beyond the capabilities of previous destroyers. Beyond the guns, the Zumwalt's true strength lies in its missile systems. The ship carries 80 vertical launch system, VLS cells arranged along the hull's outer edges, each capable of firing a wide variety of missiles. These include Tomahawk cruise missiles for land attack, standard missiles for air defense, and ASROC missiles for anti-submarine warfare. This modular missile system gives the Zumwalt incredible flexibility. It can adapt its loadout for specific missions, whether that's striking land targets, defending against incoming threats, or hunting submarines deep below the surface. The placement of these VLS cells along the periphery also enhances survivability by minimizing damage in case of a hit. 
the ZoomWalt's radar and sensor suite are equally advanced. Its dual-band radar system combines both S-band and X-band radars to provide a comprehensive view of the battle space, capable of detecting both high-altitude aircraft and sea-skimming missiles simultaneously. The ship's total ship computing environment, TSCE, integrates every system on board into a single digital network, allowing seamless communication between sensors, weapons, and command systems. This integrated architecture makes the ZoomWalt incredibly responsive. Operators can detect, track, and engage threats with unprecedented speed and accuracy. Another impressive aspect of the ZoomWalt is its adaptability. The ship's design anticipates future upgrades and technological shifts. Its large internal space, robust power system, and modular weapon architecture mean it can be reconfigured to accommodate emerging technologies like laser weapons, electromagnetic railguns, or next-generation hypersonic missiles. This future proofing ensures the ZoomWalt remains relevant for decades, even as warfare evolves at a rapid pace. In 2026, reports indicate that the ZoomWalt class is being tested and modified to carry the new conventional Prompt Strike CPS hypersonic missile system capable of hitting targets thousands of miles away in under 15 minutes. This would transform the destroyer into a key component of America's long-range strike capability. Even with all its power, the ZoomWalt is designed to minimize its environmental footprint and enhance efficiency. Its advanced propulsion system reduces fuel consumption, and its sleek hull design minimizes drag in the water. The ship is also engineered to handle rough seas better than traditional destroyers, maintaining stability and stealth even in adverse conditions. Every detail, from the integrated exhaust system that disperses heat to reduce infrared visibility, to the composite superstructure that cuts down weight, contributes to its overall efficiency and stealth. Of course, the ZoomWalt's journey hasn't been without challenges. The program has faced criticism over its high costs, with each ship estimated at around $4.5 billion, more than double the price of a standard Arleigh Burke class destroyer. Initial technical hurdles, delays, and the cancellation of some of its original weapon systems led some to question whether the ZoomWalt would live up to its promise. However, as the ship matures and new systems like hypersonic weapons are integrated, it's becoming clear that the ZoomWalt represents more than a prototype. It's a foundation for the future of naval combat. When you look at the USS ZoomWalt today, you see the Navy's vision for the next generation of maritime dominance. It's quiet, powerful, and intelligent. A stealth warship that blends automation, flexibility, and futuristic firepower in one sleek package. It may look like a ship ahead of its time, but its time is now. The ZoomWalt isn't just about fighting today's battles, it's about shaping the future of naval warfare. Whether serving as a testbed for next-gen technologies or as a frontline strike platform, the 2026 ZoomWalt stands as proof that innovation and power can coexist on the open seas. It's a symbol of what happens when cutting-edge engineering meets bold military ambition, a true marvel of modern naval design.